Good morning, YTPC. How you doing this morning? Well, it's a cool but beautiful Saturday morning. Uh, slept in a little bit today. Um, fell asleep on the couch last night. Woke up about 3.30 in the morning. Slept like a rock, though. But I went, I went right back to sleep. Decided, how with it? I'll sleep on the couch. <laughs> but I got a pretty good night's sleep. Um, smoking my Stanwell brush. In it, I have some Capstan Gold. I need to replenish this jar. So we have the granddaughter's birthday celebration today. <clears throat> she will be two years old. It will be a family affair. Most, a lot of family will be there, which is nice. My mom's actually making it up. <clears throat> so. I still have two more tins of this capstan gold. I must have got a little ahead on that, which is good. But I haven't been smoking it as much as the capstan blue because for some reason I thought I had more of that. And I don't. That's such a toss up with me, which one I like better. It is, it's a. <laughs> mm. Got a really cool breeze coming in, Ugh. but I'll tough it out. I think we're only going to get a high of like 45 degrees today, so it's not exactly warm. So how's everyone doing? How's your weekend starting? Did you have a fun Friday night? I didn't do nothing last night. Stayed home. Kind of felt like going and doing, going out. <clears throat> but just ended up not doing it. I'll give a shout out today, Saturday shout out, Pork Roll Piper, if you haven't checked out his channel, check it out.
won't be too much longer. We'll be pulling the camper out of storage. I'll start doing periodical videos from our campsites. <laughs> Definitely looking forward to that. Kind of hard to say whether or not spring has arrived. I don't really want to say it yet, but There's a lot of evidence showing up that it has. I've seen a lot of robins. Woodpeckers are all over. That's telling me that uh, they're finding bugs. But what do I know? <laughs> Uh, also do a little bit of a, a plug for another channel that I subscribe to, Buckeye Piper. He hasn't been putting out much content, but he actually put out a video yesterday um, stating that he has made the decision he's going to start selling off. He's got a bunch of tobacco and pipes and... Uh, Any of you that's familiar with his channel and you didn't see that video, it's kind of a PSA for you. Um, any interest, he's just, just email him. I know he has a, a bunch of sun bear. I might actually email him and try to get a couple tins of that. Not sure what he's looking at for <laughs> prices on things. Very peaceful morning. It's just like dead calm. Squirrels, chipmunks, birds, they're all out there just going crazy this morning. went to the we have a cork and keg like two blocks away nice liquor store me and the wife made it over there last night she got uh, some wine I picked me up a bottle of 1792 bourbon For my old fashions. I'm not like a bourbon connoisseur by any stretch, but I've been looking at more and more, doing more and more looking into it. That stuff's pretty good for the for the cost. For under under or around forty dollars. That stuff is really good. Works well in my old fashions, I know that. Speaking of old fashions, usually you put brandy in an old fashioned. Did you know more brandy gets sold in the state of Wisconsin? 
than the entire rest of the country. It might even be the entire rest of the world. I'd have to look that up. I think that's what I heard. Isn't that crazy? They love their old fashions in Wisconsin. <clears throat> So there is another uh, pipe club, Chicago Pipe Club meeting tonight. I don't think I'm going to go just because of how the day is. Has, uh, there's a lot going on today. So any of you that subscribe to my channel or watch this video and you're in that area, Go check it out if you haven't been to any. Go sign up. It's like 25 bucks. I think a year for a year. Meetings are awesome. They always have just a huge selection of pipe tobacco sitting out for you to try. So there's lots of things that you never tried it. They usually feed you. They'll do a, uh, a raffle drawing, which I won one last time. Won me a tin of tobacco. You'll get to probably meet Gary from Olden in the Way. Jeff the Chef. Mm. Stop. People like to complain how much cap stand, the, the cost of cap stand, but. It's worth it to me. It's just something you can't just like. <clears throat> it's not an everyday smoke because because of the cost. I probably average maybe <clears throat> three bowls a week of each, and it lasts me quite a quite a while. Considering how much some of the sought-after tobaccos cost, <clears throat> it's actually not that expensive. And many of those, I'm pretty sure I would not enjoy nearly as much as I enjoy this. By the way, I did a video. I smoked some moon trance in a video. It was a few videos ago. I was actually on uh, pipes and cigars last night, looking around. That stuff's under nine bucks a tin. Yeah. Can't go wrong with that. Heck, I think a pouch of Captain Black might cost more than that. It's 
sorry this video wasn't wasn't a whole lot of pipe related conversation but that's kind of what you get with this channel um it's not always going to be about pipes or tobacco i made that comment in somebody else's video the other day i said if you just strictly stick with pipes and tobacco you're probably going to gain subscribers a lot faster um or i would have i think but That's just not what I want to do on my channel. I really, it's more, the YTPC, many might disagree, but the YTPC, it's, it's more than just pipes and tobacco, cigars. It's what it's called a community. It's friendship, camaraderie. It's all that. So that's kind of why I designed the channel to do the, do the videos I do. Probably appeals to some people, some people it doesn't. <clears throat> it's probably why my <clears throat> subcount does this. People, some people probably get tired of coming in wanting to hear about pipes or tobacco. And they just kind of hear me ramble and Eh, but that's okay. Anyway, I hope everyone has a terrific Saturday. Safe weekend. Till next time, keep them lit.